Aloha, this is Bear Wozniak coming to you from my home in Waikiki Beach. I'm looking across the channel, past Diamond Head in the background, and then across that channel is the Molokai uh, Channel. It's about 27 miles wide. And I used to have a home in Molokai, you know, the home of St. Damien and St. Mary Ann. My father was a deacon there. But I would sit at my home in Molokai, and I'd look across that channel, the Kiavi Channel, and go, you know what? I could paddle that thing on my tandem surfboard. People do it on special kind of paddle boards, outrigger canoes, stand-up paddle boards. Back then, no one was stand-up paddling. But I thought, I can do that. And of course, the minute you say, I could do that, it gnaws on you. It just gnaws on you. So I scheduled the time. I made a, I made a, made an appointment date on my calendar to make that paddle. I got up about 4 in the morning. So when I left Molokai, I was up in, it was in the middle of the night. But I had set my compass on my surfboard. And when I looked at my compass, it was pointing directly at the full moon that was setting on its way to setting into Diamond Head Crater. Uh, once I lay down on the board, I couldn't see the crater, but I could see uh, the full moon, and I followed that moon. I followed my compass. I followed the course. In our lives, sometimes we lose our way. And it's important just to keep going and going. You know, the thing about it, when I pedaled my bicycle across the United States, when I paddled my outrigger, my, my surfboard, 27 miles ac across the Molokai Channel, the whole key to that was one pedal stroke at a time on my bicycle, one paddle stroke at a time on my surfboard. As soon as you enter into an adversity, you're on your way out. The key is to set your compass, to follow God's will, to stay the course. And as soon as you enter into a, uh, the desert, you're on your way out the other side. So stay the course, follow the true setting that you have in the Catechism of the Catholic Church and the sacraments. This is Bear Wozniak from DeepAdventure.com.